You can use it on gravel. You can use it on concrete, asphalt. Lorna Davison is a Tennessee farmer who's planting the seeds of an idea that it's easy to grow a garden when you plant in straw bales. You want to saturate the bale. Then I saw on her Facebook page uh, a picture of the straw bale gardening. And when I looked at that, I just said, that's it, I can do this. Going to put our transplant in. This just sounds like such an easy, uh, back saving way of, uh, of looking at gardening. Davidson says straw bale gardening requires almost no tools, is inexpensive, and can be used for either seeds or seedlings. Best of all, the bales can be stacked to make gardening a lot more comfortable. Another benefit, you won't have to weed. Lorna says just make sure you're using straw and not hay, because hay is an animal feed that can be contaminated with all kinds of seeds. Abundance of food can be created over the next 12 to 18 months out of these three bales. Davidson uses straw bales on her large-scale commercial farm. She says anyone can do it anywhere, opening up possibilities for community gardens in places that are normally too wet or contaminated by storm runoff. You don't know what's in the ground in Long Beach, and so I thought that this would be a way of get of of uh, regenerating the earth. In Old Westbury, I'm Mary Musi, News 12, Long Island.